Hello, Burnaby, and welcome to this week's edition of the Burnaby Wrap. I want to start by congratulating all of our students who have finished the state test for the year. Thank you for doing your best and being flexible with all the schedule changes. Great job, everybody. Moving on, let's recognize some Burnaby students using their power of one. First, Mrs. Pocock noticed that Eric Young used his power of one by helping Carayson try to find her coat when the bus was already waiting. And Mrs. Priesa noticed that Liam Miracle used his power of one by helping another student study for a math test. Great job, guys. So for the rest of our time today, I wanted to talk about communication. It's something that keeps coming up with students these past few weeks, so I thought it would be a good idea to spend some time with it here. So quick question. How much of your communication or the message you send comes from your words? Is it 70%? 80%? Actually, some estimates say that only 7% of what we're saying comes from our words. The rest comes from our body language, tone of voice, all of our nonverbal stuff. So sometimes we say one thing, but the message we send with our bodies is totally different. So the next time you're talking to a friend, choose your words carefully, but be even more careful with what your body language is saying. Last but not least, special shout out to all of our fifth graders graduating from D.A.R.E. today. Congratulations, everybody. That's all for now. Have a great weekend, and as always, be, be kind, kind, be true, be you. Be you. Be you.